What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another episode of Trailer Reaction Review. It has been a very long time since I did one of these. No explanation needed. It's just been a while I, as you can see behind me. I'm building out the studio. I need more lights and stuff like that to get it up to the level I wanted to. However, today we have a special occasion. The Pokemon company dropped two new trailers, one in Japanese, one in English, of the Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee games. Obviously, we're gonna take a look at them and trailer reaction review to them. So let's pop these trailers in and let's see what new stuff can we learn from these trailers. Let's jump into it. Let's just jump directly into it. Let's see. Okay. We got Pikachu and Eevee. Let's go Pikachu and Eevee. Okay, cool. Explore Kanto like number four, riding on Charizard, riding on Lapras. The sound is beautiful. Oh my god, like the sound effects? That's really alive. What else? We got Magikarp bouncing around. Your friendly rival, okay. And he has the opposite Pokemon, I guess. Your hopeful Pokemon expert, Professor Oak. We get the- that was starters? We get to pick starters? Bond with your partner? I wonder, are we gonna be able to pick our starter and get Pikachu? Okay, male and female, so... Are they gonna let us choose? Customize your character and... Oh, that's lit! What the fuck? <laughs> they gave... They gave fucking Pikachu a toupee? What was that? Okay, select... Alright, Arcanine. What is it? What is that? Then Ryan found something in the ground. Oh, okay. So just like Pikachu showing the, the, the wave in the tail, they could, um, wave the tail too. Got Misty action with Starmie. Okay. Go out play, we know. Yo, the fucking rat attack, the way he's just like running wild in the world. It's just like, it looks like he living, like he chilling. Battle together. Same stuff that we knew. Trade together, local or online. Okay. And that's pretty much it. That was lit. These are lit trailers. That was a lit trailer. Okay. Let's jump on the, straight into it. Straight into it. No, no, no wait, no wait. Let's go into the Japanese side. Now, obviously, I'm not going to know what the fuck they saying, but let's go to it. Whoa, is that a map? Was that like a map of the area? Can I throw that back? I'm not gonna understand it anyway. That was like a map, right? Yeah! Okay. That's lit. Oh, that is fire. I, I might have to steal that little... Change the text in the middle. Oh my god. Oh, we got the Nintendo Switch in the crib. Obviously, you know. This is fire. Okay, we got a little bit of backstory on this guy, our rival. Even though I, if you get attacked by Pidgey and then your your Pokemon will come out and save the day. It looks like we got the gym battles. Yeah, we know. We got Brock. Okay, Brock. Oh, that's Misty Gym. Oh, that's crazy. Sun is on the diving board. It looks so like to compare it, Jesus Christ, from those classic games. Like you would never envision that they were on diving boards in those games. They weren't on diving. They were in the pool. That's like, whoa, we got new areas. Where's this water from at? Yo, Pikachu with camo. They got camo Pikachu. What the fuck? That is so lit, though. That is so lit. You gonna poke Eevee in the butt? <laughs> okay, this is lit. Charmeleon, Charizard flying, Arcanine, oh. Butterfree, finding, what is it, finding stuff? Okay, all right, Vulpix. This is so lit. So lit, so lit, so lit. 
Okay, Pokeball Plus. Sell it to us. Sell it to us. Yep. Sell it. Sell it to us. $50 meal. Sell it to us. All right, all right. Cool. All right. So, to be honest, as trailers, they were good. They were well, well produced. They showed what I believe they wanted to show. You know, they didn't go extra and beyond. I mean, it's a little long while still until these games are fully released. And I believe they kind of kind of be pumping out the trailers more frequently, at least one every, probably every other month. And I wouldn't be surprised if that's the case, just to dump load some information because we got a lot of information here that we kind of knew. It's just, they just digging deeper. Like we knew we were gonna get um, character customization. We knew Pikachu female were gonna be um, appearing in the game. You know, that's a feature that wasn't in the, I believe that wasn't in the first um, Pokemon game, the first generation. That's why it's a big deal. This hairstyle shit is is crazy. Look at fucking Pikachu in the hand with the, with the hair. It's kind of bugged out to see. Look, even Eevee got it. Oh my God, like, okay. <laughs> This would look funny. Yo, I have to do, I'm gonna do a whole um, um, video on the breakdown of these trailers. But this trailers overall, if I had to give them a grade, I'm gonna I'm be unfair because when I'm a Pokemon fan, two, I'm grading two trailers and putting them together. I'm gonna have to give this a five, boys. Like, I, I have to. Then again, you might say I'm biased, but say that I'm biased and, and leave the comment, leave it in the comment section below. But there was literally nothing in this trailer that I could spot off that is like, I don't know why they put this there. It seems wrong or anything. Yo, Misty, yo, Misty in here. Misty in here looking so good. Not good like I want to smash it away, but I mean like her character design is lit. I'm liking the way, the direction they went with it. It's the same thing how I felt about Barack. I felt like it's just like one of these little pop figure toys, but it works. It works for this design that they're going for in this whole world. Everything is just vibrant with colors and stuff like that. Everything just, it just, it just fits for um, a game like this. For a Pokemon game, you want it on the Switch, you want it to look at a certain way. And you want the, again, the highlighted being on the monsters, and that is exactly what they're doing. They're making the Pokemon look, number one, the best, and then focusing on everything else. Oh my God, these are just so good. These are just so good. I'm, I mean, maybe I am being biased. Let me know in the comment section below the grade you will give these trailers. I'm, I'm gonna have to give them together a five. They just, it's just, uh, it's just so good. It's so good to see Pokemon at this level of quality, just art, design, movement, and just seeing like from where they come to where is that now. And oh my God, these environments, I wanna dig through, through it. I'm gonna do trailer deep dive-ins on both of these trailers and see everything we can find within them. Um, let me know in the comment section below anything that you want particularly tr me try to coop up or not even coop up, but try to explain or give my opinion on rather in the comment section below if you see anything of like my thoughts on these games in the comment section below i'll probably go over it in my pokemon news daily which i'm gonna have a pop-up right here on top of my head so you guys can check out the show it's a new show i'm doing it produces a pokemon show every day with topics and discussions and covering all the news around Pokemon, let's go Pikachu and let's go Eevee, but also all the Pokemon games, including Pokemon Quest and you know Pokemon Go. So this is lit. We got Ammo. Look at Camo Pikachu though. We got Camo Pikachu. Forget the hat. I had the Safari hat. You kind of looking like Mario with the Safari outfit on. Take that off, Pikachu. I want to leave Pikachu in that camo shirt all game. Please let me get that early on in the game because that is lit right there. That is lit. We got camo shirt Pikachu in the game. I'm, I'm a camo guy, so maybe I'm just too excited for that. But that is lit. That is lit. Let me know what you guys would give these both of these two trailers in the comment section below. Let me know your thoughts on my grade of giving it a five. And also let me know your hype level for Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee, the games. I'm gonna have to see you guys on the next one. I'm too hyped for these games. I'm too hyped for these games. Nothing could take me down. I don't think so. Even paying 
fucking fifty dollars from you. Let me know your thoughts on it in the comment section below. Like always, guys, I'm Daddy I'm a Fred on Instagram and Twitter, and you guys can bring the conversation there. I'm the American gamer in Switzerland, right here on YouTube. And yes, I'm gonna be doing a ton of videos just like this one. So if you enjoy, please hit that subscribe button. Also hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned. Ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time I drop a video. Peace. I'm gonna see you guys on the next one.